Holy That's them diggings that got away from us all day. Hey, you ain't gonna believe what video I just got. My gun keeps hanging out. I don't have to get me a new gun. See, that's a big son of a gun right there. Yeah, that right there. My God! Look at the on That sucker looked at you fixing a charge. He's trying to. But... My gosh, how big is that pea? A... Look how thick he is. Yeah. Big dog. Well, we just hunt trophies. Yeah. <laughs> how you gotta get dogs off of him? Yeah. Come here, Jack. Let him go to fighting. Dang, he's pussed on him. My. They done been cut. Somebody done caught, cut them. Cause that one cut too, gotta be. Sitting here in Door Street River Bottoms, me and my friend is bait up and kill two of the best possible hogs you could. See, before we killed these hogs, years ago, somebody caught these as little pigs and castrated them. And that's the reason that they're so fat and they're so in such good shape. Um, it doesn't change their aggressiveness. They are still very mad. As you can see, we was about to get charged by them whenever some quick lever action worked by my friend took them out. Um, but these are fat hogs. We've done good at them. They've got two inches of fat on their belly. Um, a lot of people say that a, a hog is no good to eat. Well, folks, this right here is a fine, fine hog to kill, fine to eat. It's going to make some really good uh, uh, meals for a lot of folks. Uh, we're going to put this meat to good use. Um, the dogs that bait them, that, it couldn't ask for better dogs. Dogs that are baying hogs with teeth like this that don't get cut, that speaks for themselves. Um, that shows you that they know what they're doing. Um, this hog here, uh, my friend took the shot at. He didn't want to shoot the dog, so he shot it kind of high up to break him down. Um, but the dogs were running around it in such a manner as he had to take the best shot he could. Well, after that, the hog started to come over this log that we're sitting here beside, and that's whenever he put one through his head. Uh, the hog was, was fixing, he was very aggressive. He was fixing to do what he could to take care of us. Um, the other hog, he, you know, he, he stayed and he was fighting a good fight. The dogs did their their part throughout the whole morning. They've hunted. We this we've been gone about four miles. Um, no tracks, no sign. The first bit of sign we came to, the dogs trailed them up, probably a quarter of a mile. Dogs went missing. We're sitting there, we're listening, we're listening. Finally, we hear the dogs bay. And this is what we got. These are two fine hogs to. Eat. I don't know what they weigh, but they're big. We will put them on scales whenever we get out and we start dressing them. But uh, this is what it's all about. This is a good time that we had this morning, a good hunt, a good Lord's blessing. Redneck hog hoisting. The foil is still about four inches off the ground, is it? Is it? Yeah. That's a big hog. Two shoddy pigs. Uh oh. She's just like a mother. <laughs> 